I don't usually come into town if I can help it. It's very odd, me being here today. Puts one's whole week out. Well, there's always the country at the weekend. Yes. Unless Hector has to work, and he's had to work a lot recently. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. This whole week, in fact, he's not been home. I say to him, I say, Hector, they should pay you more. <laughs> Just <sighs> excuse me for a moment. At least you're not his secretary. See, I knew you were an intelligent woman. I knew I wouldn't have to say much. Usually it's with one of those silly little girls. I'm just glad that with a clever woman like you, you do fully understand. He just can't control himself. I think it's the creative in him. I mean, they say Picasso has a whole heap of lovers. Not that I'm putting Hector on par with an artiste like that, but there is always someone. It's actually a relief to finally meet a proper woman. And I do like you, Belle. Very much. Marnie. I, um... He's always just on loan, and he always comes back to me. I don't know what I Do you love him? Because I do. Very much. Would you like me to call you a taxi? No. Thank you. Do tell Hector I called by. You know in South America they don't drink milk. <laughs> That's why all the old people are so frail. They think it's bad for you. The drinking milk is bad for you. But how come? Something to do with sacred cows, I don't know. Why don't they just eat grass? I mean, how do cows get milk? They eat grass. If you eat grass and that's a primary source, better than a secondary source. Eating grass is better than drinking milk. You'd have to eat a hell of a lot of grass. I like astrology. You know, Venus is in your first house at the moment, and because you're a Scorpio, that means you might just get a shag. We're doing this for us, not for them. Why? What difference will it make? I don't know. Grace, I can't articulate it right this second. Yeah, neither can I. <sighs> Look, if we stop now, then that's it. They won't allow us to try again. When we first met, I explained this was part of the situation. I know. You're doing so well. We're halfway there. So what are you meant to be then? I'm a doctor. Oh, that's really cool. You're, you're an angel. Oh, well, thank you very much. <laughs> what are you so nervous for? Relax. Don't you usually talk to girls? I, I don't normally come out. No. Oh, really? Oh, well, I feel privileged then. <laughs> Do you think I'm a pretty angel? Yeah. Do you, uh... She fancy me.